Hello, uh, it's your girl Tiffany, the Luscious Black Beauty, your Poetic Psychic Pisces High Priestess, aka the Lake that shines like a diamond, also known as your mother and a nun, one who is done within a coven, a convent, or a covenant. I do thank you all for listening and for watching on today. If you would be so kind to please like, share, and subscribe, it would be greatly, greatly appreciated. This is going to be a general reading for the overall collective of any zodiac sign. So please take the rest that apply. Leave the ones that do not. Remember that this reading may apply to your past, your present, or your future, as well as it may be pertaining to you or any and everyone in between that you may or may not know. With that being said, guys, I hope y'all are doing well and feeling well. I would like to thank all of the subscribers, all of the people who are the first time viewers okay as well as returning viewers guys so let's see what messages spirit has for you all today okay so oh goodness wait a minute so I was about to say that somebody could be coming into wealth, honey, but it looks like someone who has wealth or has been used to having some type of wealth or riches or um, may now be in worry. There, somebody is losing a lot of money and this has somebody in mental conflict. Somebody is stressed, worried, depressed, dealing with anxiety here. There's a lot of cards are flipped over here yeah yeah somebody has literally gone from like the ten of coins to the five of coins okay and the five of coins is like lack okay it's 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 um in need of help assistance struggling uh a lack of support or help or finances, money, resources, stability, and security, okay? This has really got somebody in mental conflict. They're like stressed, worried, depressed, dealing with anxiety, having sleepless nights, dealing with insomnia. Um, they're worrying, okay? Somebody has literally gone from wealth to worry, okay? I feel like this person got their wealth by, like, obviously... Uh, decisions that they made, but this person went to the crossroads, okay? I feel like they probably this could be somebody that sold they sold for their wealth, okay? Um, it could have become very uh, rich or famous or um, however they got their wealth. They definitely went to the crossroads. They, they, you know, they had to make their decision to go in a particular direction and, and to, you know, do certain things to get this wealth here, okay? Now this person is like feeling like a failure. It's like um, whatever effort, energy, time that they have put into something. Like even this person's investments are failing. Okay. And most people make investments in an effort to like... Uh, Come into some type of harvest from that investment at some point in time here. Yeah, this person is definitely in mental conflict, okay? Because there's some type of judgment that is going on, some type of judgment, action, or decisions that has been made that's got this person in mental conflict, that's got this person, like, stressed and worried and dealing with anxiety. Yeah, somebody, this person is definitely crying over spilled milk here, okay? Um... Something could have to do with this person's job, their work, okay? Something could also have to do with some type of collaboration or contractual agreement in some type of way. Due to some type of collaboration or contractual agreement, this person could have uh, lost money, okay? Spirit, what else is going on here? Yeah. This person is in sorrow right now, like heartache, heartbreak, sadness, sorrow, misery, pain, anguish. Like, over this situation here, okay? Somebody is also worried about death here. Either somebody is heartbroken over a, a death here. This this death doesn't... Like, this death could be, like, a death to um, their status, okay? A death to um, their wealth, their stability, their security, their... You know what I'm saying? But this person could also be, like... 
either somebody physically died and it's got this person heartbroken over this and maybe you know what i'm saying their their wealth and everything is dwindling has dwindled since and it has to be a mental conflict or either this is the death of like say this person's business or you know death of person's places or things basically in this person's life here okay but this could also tell us that this person is worried about death here okay this person may be uh in fear of dying or think that's not that they're going to be killed okay there any other messages mm -mm. damn the swords is at the bottom of the deck so this person could be feeling stuck restricted unable to move or get out of a situation uh this person could be feeling trapped like they're captive like they're stuck like they're hostage in a situation this person somebody could have even gotten locked up for something like this could be jail or imprisonment as well here i'm seeing the three of cups with the four of swords here something is significant to some type of gathering get together celebration party um a coming together with others um third party situations okay whatever has got this person in heartache and heartbreak here because you got two threes here 33 here three of swords three of cups here okay it has to do with some type of coming together gathering get together um we and we also seen the three of coins here so this person is definitely a part of some type of collaborations and contractual agreements here okay but like i said there could be some type of gathering get together party celebration coming together with others okay um and there could have been something heartbreaking that took place, some type of third party situation that could be uh, that is causing this person some type of heartache, heartbreak, sadness, sorrow, misery, pain or anguish here. OK, because the three of cups and the four of swords came out together here. OK, so a death has occurred because of a four of swords situation here. Somebody could have gotten hurt or injured. Maybe at some type of party, gathering, get together, celebration, coming together with others in some type of way, shape, form, or fashion. This person could have been a part of this. Okay? So this person is definitely in sorrow over a death that has occurred here. Okay? And this has to do with some type of uh, situation of, you know, like um, a coming together with others. The Four of Swords can talk about, sometimes a Four of Swords can talk about a truth, but more often than not, the Four of Swords can speak to somebody being hurt or injured in need of help or assistance, hospitalization, recovery, recuperation, healing, um, or something in some type of way here. With it sitting on top of death here, somebody definitely was injured, okay? Somebody could have, have succumbed to their injuries and ended up dying here, okay? This person could be either in jail uh, at risk of going to jail or prison for something could be the reason why this person is losing has gone to from wealth to worry they could be coming out of a lot of money for something mm -mm. Mm. yeah i'm seeing the prince of cups here which talks about the filmmaker I'm also seeing a queen of wands here, fire signs, such as Aries or Leo. There's a lot of people here. I'm seeing the prince of cups, the queen of wands, the princess of swords, the two of cups, the emperor. Hmm. Damn, the prince of discs, the princess of wands. Six of Swords, the Tower. There was a lot of people. Okay. I'm literally hearing come together <laughs> right now over me. <laughs> um, if y'all have ever heard that song, that come together song, okay? Um, but something tragic has definitely taken place. Somebody could literally be in jail for something or either somebody is feeling stuck, restricted, unable to move or something. 
Something has to do with this fire sign, though. A Sagittarius, Aries, or Leo, okay? A large amount of money here. There being some type of betrayal, disloyalty, sabotage, ruin, ending of some kind here. So this person is feeling stuck, trapped, restricted, unable to move or get out of a situation. Could have even gone to jail or could be facing prison. And it's because of a fire sign here. Sagittarius, Aries, or Leo. And something with the nine of coins being here, okay? I don't know if this person, like, paid this person off for something or about something here. But it's like this person is, like, still, there's, like, eight of swords, ten of swords energy here, okay? Yeah. And there's an air sign, Aquarius, Libra, Gemini, that could be causing some type of conflict or defeat or something. Uh, problem of some kind with the air sign as well. This Prince of Cups here, this is a water sign, Scorpio, Cancer, Pisces here. This is the filmmaker. This person could have recorded something at this gathering, get together, celebration. Yeah. This, this injury, this uh, death or what have you, it could have happened to uh, this fire sign individual. Let's see if those energies come back out though, okay? Spirit, what else is going on here? seeing the chariot with the six of coins here something about traveling trafficking um, trips journeys relocations the devil Yeah, Spirit is saying that's the truth. That's clarity here. So whatever this function, this could have been somebody who was like um, maybe uh, trafficked there. Or maybe was, was, was promised some type of compensation for uh, them being trafficked to this gathering, get together, celebrations, parties or something. But this person ended up getting severely injured or hurt or something like that. This person may have even succumbed to their injuries and died here, okay? Perhaps it was covered up. Fair, what is this death for a source? What is this death for a source? So, five of cups. There was definitely some type of sadness, loss, disappointment, and regret. As it relates to the situation here. There's a there's an air sign though. There's an air sign individual who was there, Aquarius, Libra, Gemini. They they are the ones who is could be like the direct cause of what happened to this person. But it's also a water sign masculine. Scorpio Cancer Pisces. Because there's something, there's something here. There was some type of, yeah, I'm seeing it here again. There was some type of uh, altercation here with this air sign here. There was some type of conflict or defeat, fighting, fussing, cussing, arguments, disagreements, misunderstanding in some way, shape, form, or fashion. Okay? That broke out. That led to this situation here. Okay? Yeah, five of wands could be jealousy, envy, hatred, spitefulness, competition, strife. Mm -mm. Eight of swords again. Somebody could have literally been held hostage, captive. Uh, somebody could have been restricted in some type of way. Been stuck in prison in some type of way. Yeah, there's a water sign, okay? This person has a lot of success. This person is showing up at, with success. It's a star. 
Yeah, it has triumph and victory here. Could be an artist of some kind here. Yeah, I'm seeing something. Something has to do with pleasure in the past. This, there's a water sign and an air sign that did, or excuse me, yeah, 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 that was right. A water sign and an air sign that did something together that caused, like, the severe injury and death to this person here. Because, like I said, there was some type of conflict here. Okay, I'm seeing the Five of Swords and the Five of Wands here. Some type of conflict, defeat, some type of jealousy, envy, hatred, spitefulness, competition. Okay. Yeah. Ten of Swords, betrayal, sabotage, ruin, fatal endings. Yeah. I'm seeing the chariot in the eight of swords here. Somebody definitely could have been picked up and arrested here. Or either this is somebody who was trafficked and held hostage or captive in a situation here. But I feel like somebody in this situation may have been arrested as it relates to this 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 situation. Yeah. Yeah, somebody could be dealing with some dealing with like some type of justice or legal situation, legal matter as it relates to this, okay? Yeah. This has to do with the fire sign individual here. Somebody's dealing with a lot of burdens, hardships, and problematic situations over this as well. If this person died, their death was definitely covered up, okay? Whoever this art or uh, air sign is, this person is like a, this person is being seen as like, like the game master. I'm seeing game master and, uh, the water sign is being seen as the film. It says filmmaker. This this water sign recorded this situation that happened. Like it's on video. It's on tape. There could have also been an earth sign there who is like a day trader. This is day trader. Spirit, what else? Somebody is a hacker as well. Or somebody is trying to get something hacked or removed. This could have been a masculine or a feminine energy. The person that this happened to. This could be a masculine or a feminine energy. Seriously, and that's the truth. That's clarity, okay? There could be some type of truth or clarity that is coming out in this situation here. I'm hearing same sex. Spirit is saying same sex, okay? So, like, um, all these persons could be the same sex. Something about pleasure in the past. Okay. These are also persons who have like luxury. This, um... This Six of Cups here, like I said, the Six of Cups is about the past. It's nostalgia. It's memories and different things like that. So somebody could be like, you know, 
taking a stroll back down memory lane, got this on their mind, especially with the Nine of Swords here, okay, thinking about this situation, but this was like pleasure at the time, okay, I've seen a lot of people here, this could have been some type of like uh, gathering, like we know that there was some type of gathering, get together, celebration, like I'm literally hearing that song, if y'all ain't never heard that song, come together, listen to it, okay, um, Y'all don't even understand. A lot of music, a lot of things that y'all hear, it has other meanings to it that you you don't even know what it means, okay? But that song was literally <laughs> uh, talking about, like, some orgy shit and some other shit, okay? And, uh, like, <laughs> yeah. that. But that's what that come together <laughs> right now over me. That's a fucking orgy, bro, okay? Um yeah um there's a lot of people the beatles i believe that was the beatles song okay but there's a lot of people who covered it like um i can see them do it really good i like their version of it but uh gary clark oh my god that man is so stupid on that damn electric guitar oh child but Michael Jackson covered it. Uh, a lot of people covered it, okay? If you never heard it come together, I'm telling you, this situation is like, like, like that song goes hand in hand with this situation. That's like literally what I'm hearing. Like this has to be like some type of orgy party or something, okay? Hey, come on, flat top, he got. Y'all gotta go listen to that song, okay? Anyway, I ain't gonna get into it. But. This has something to do with pleasure. Whoever this person is, they could be of another race as well here because I'm seeing like multiple races here, okay? Like this person could have been Caucasian. They don't necessarily have to be here. I'm seeing a brown skin arm and a Caucasian arm here as well. So, but like, yeah. Mm -mm. This water sign recorded something, though. They coming out as the filmmaker. It's interesting because I feel like these are grown men. But they're coming out in, like, uh, especially in this situation, very, like, careless, reckless, childish uh, type of energy. Okay, guys. <laughs> Sorry, I'm singing this song. Um, let's um. Hold on, guys. Let's um. Uh, let's get some more clarification for the situation and see what the hell else um is going on. I don't even know <sighs> which deck I want to use. Um. Okay, Spirit, clarify this uh, Ten of Coins. Why is this Ten of Coins here? So this person, damn, really? This person made their money off of collaborating, uh, contractual agreements, lying. This person is a swindler. This person made they wealth got like got they wealth out of like lying, cheating, stealing, swindling, uh, contracts, collaborations, and things like literally the three of coins with the three of swords came out on the ten of pentacles, which speaks to wealth. Okay. Mm -mm. This person literally got they wealth from swindling others. Okay. Spirit, clarify the five of coins here. I'm seeing judgment again. Why has this person gone from the Ten of Coins to the Five of Coins, okay? Yeah, because of a tower, okay? There has been like a sudden upheaval, okay? Um, a shakeup of things, a shocking event. Uh, uh, this person could, this, damn. This person could file, have to file for bankruptcy, okay? Something was immediate, like a lightning strike. Something happened like all of a sudden out the blue, okay? There's a revelation. Something was sudden, a wipeout, okay? Uh, destroyed okay chaos tragedy okay sudden upheaval okay mm -mm. I'm seeing the nine of wands with the higher thing here okay um somebody is very defensive here okay 
very defensive, maybe even hostile, trying to protect themselves, uh, feel like they need some type of protection, okay, uh, trying to defend themselves in some type of way, uh, feel like a sacrifice is needing to be made here, nine of wands with the higher thing here, this could be, this could be somebody who holds some type of religious traditions, this person could be in a position of rulership, leadership, or power in some type of way here. Uh, this could be a religious leader, but it doesn't, doesn't necessarily have to be, even though the Hierophant do speak about faith, okay? But it also speaks about programming, conforming institutions, conventions, values, and so forth, okay? This could be any person who has some type of position of power, authority, leadership, in any type of way, shape, form, or fashion. The interesting thing about this, I feel like this is like, about more than like more than one person there's a lot of people involved here okay there's a lot of people involved here so there's like in me the reason why i'm saying that is because I, i'm feeling like multiple different energies here there could be multiple energies in this energy just in this setting of this one reading here okay yeah, I'm also seeing justice here with the tower and justice here. Somebody's definitely dealing with some, 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 some really heavy legalities in a situation here, okay? Um, consequences. Legal matters and consequences is what I'm seeing here, okay? Because of a situation. Um, nine of swords, spirit. Nine of swords. So, yeah. I'm, I feel like this is a side note for one of these persons here, okay? So, either this, either this. It could be both of these individuals because I feel like this reading here has to do with, besides this this fire sign here, who was at this, this uh, you know, come together session <laughs> um, that I'm going to call it. Um, the other face cards we have here is an air sign and a water sign here. And I feel like they both, one of these people are uh, a higher fan. Okay, they both could be in higher fan energy, but one of them is definitely uh, in a higher fan energy, and they're definitely in the nine of wands here, okay? But I'm seeing the five of swords in the world on the nine of swords here. So the reason for there being mental conflict, stress, worry, depression, anxiety, okay, is because of some type of conflict, hostility, defeat, okay? Uh, this is self-sacrificing energy, a plot twist, okay? Um some type of conflict and defeat that has caused um, with the world here an end of a chapter, a completion of a cycle, something coming to an end in some type of way, okay? Spirit, clarify the two of swords. Yeah. So I feel like this person has definitely made some, some bad decisions. Like, I, I feel like this two of swords is, it talks about this person... Whoever this person is that went to the crossroads, I feel like they went to the crossroads and they sold it, sold to a devil, okay? They made a deal with Papa Legba and they in the pockets of the powers that be, period, point blank. They sold their soul and they ass to the devil, period, okay? Um, and because I'm seeing the four of cups with the three of wands here, okay? But I'm telling you, this person got their wealth, this ten of pentacles, okay? Like, when this person went to the crossroads, they was only offered like the four of cups, three of wands. So they was very motivated and determined, manifesting their dreams, big developments happening, uh, you know, travel for pleasure and work and, and level up progress type, you know what I'm saying? This is like, this person's come up, you know what I'm saying? The decision they made for they come up here, but it was a small offer that they originally received. But this person got to the point of wealth due to three of coins, seven of swords here, okay? collaborations, contractual agreements, uh, working together with others, okay? The Seven of Swords, though, is lying, cheating, stealing, betrayal, sneaky, manipulating, wearing a mask, very strategic, cowardly, doing things under false pretenses, carrying things away, okay? Self, being only focused on one's own self-interest, okay? But yeah, this person has literally gone from wealth to worry, from ten of pentacles to nine of, or, or from ten of pentacles to five of pentacles, okay? Like seriously, okay? This person is at a whole hell of a lot of money. Um, um, and this person is feeling like a failure right now. This person may even have to file for bankruptcy or something like that. Spirit clarify, um, 
I'm also seeing the seven of coins here, though, okay? So it's like all this person's hard work, effort, uh, investment, time, energy. There's no harvest coming in for this person. And this person is feeling like a failure in some type of way. Um, mm -mm. Yeah, because we got the fool here because this person was foolish. This person foolishly, blindly took, uh, blindly, careless, recklessly took leaps of faith. Okay? Yeah. Look at this shit here. The magician, the king of cups. Ten of cups. God damn. This person may even be a warlock. Mm -mm. But this person was very foolish, very careless, very reckless, okay? They took blind leaps of faith, okay? Um, this person is also very, uh, very much free-spirited, but like, I feel like in a careless, reckless kind of way. With the fool and the magician being here, though, I feel like this person abused divination by way of manipulation in an effort to uh, manipulate man the manifestations that they wanted, okay? This person, um, it's like a resourceful creator, has a lot of real willpower and influence, okay? This person is a master manifester, but they are a master manipulator. Which is what brings about their manifestations, okay? A lot of inspired action with this person here. This person is definitely a warlock, okay? This person um, practices the dark arts, black magic, voodoo, okay? Witchcraft, sorcery, santeria, or any other type of forms of, of dark arts here, okay? Um, mm -hmm. And this could be this King of Cups here, because this came out, we got the Fool first, and then the Magician and the King of Cups came out together, okay? So this could be this Water Sign Masculine, okay? Um, he's also an emotional manipulator. He has like a, um, he has like emotional mastery, so he's an emotional manipulator. And a warlock. This person is artistic. Okay. Spirit, what is this judgment about? Why is judgment here? Why is judgment here? So this person is in mental conflict because of some type of judgment, decision, or action that has been taken here. I'm seeing the emperor here. So this is a masculine individual who's of the establishment, someone who is action-oriented, gets things done, uh, someone who is protective, okay? This person may hold a position of power, authority, or leadership. This person is grounded, stable, secure. This person is a leader. This person is a father in some way, shape, form, or fashion. This, this King of Cups had some type of partnership or relationship with this Emperor, okay? Unless this is the same energy here. Spirit, what is this judgment? Clarify judgment for us again. These people, somebody could have received some type of swift, fast communication messages, news, or information from a fire sign as well. A fire sign masculine here, I'm seeing. Spirit, what is this judgment? Why is judgment here? Why is judgment here? I'm seeing judgment again. Why is judgment here, spirit? Some type of action definitely was taken. Mm -hmm. Why is judgment here the devil? So we got the emperor and the devil on judgment here. 
I'm telling you, these individuals definitely sold their soul to the devil here. Like, this person is, like, at the mercy of the satanic powers that be, the shadow government, the wickedness in high places, okay? This can talk about some wealthy, elite, powerful people, uh, even more so than this person here. Because this person is chained to the devil. They are bound by this, this, this toxic... Uh, demonic sinister energy here okay uh, this judgment has to do with with somebody way up okay um, yeah Yeah, I'm seeing that that water sign air sign energy at the bottom of the deck with the there's some type of secret knowledge or secret information that is known about them or is out about them. There's some type of gossip rumors that's circulating, okay? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Spirit, clarify, uh, what is this? Five of Swords, or no, what's that? Three of Swords, Three of Cups, the Devil. Three of Swords, Three of Cups, the Devil. So I'm seeing the Five of Cups. So we got the Five of Cups over here. Damn, it was it was it, the Five of Cups and the and the Three of Swords came out again. Okay, so something very something heartbreaking. Like there was sorrow in some type of third party situation that went on at one of these come together parties. Okay. The devil is definitely in the details. So it was all lust, temptation, desires, uh, sex, sexuality, toxicities, addictions, bad habits, like you name it, okay? Um, and something ended tragically, okay? Five of Cups, Three of Swords again. So the, the, the Five of Cups is about... Um, an unwelcome change, it's grief, it's sadness, it's loss, it's a mourning, okay, it's emotional baggage, baggage. Um, it's someone resisting change, it's sadness, sorrow, misery, pain, anguish, the three of swords is deep emotional pain, grief, disillusionment, sorrow, depression, heartbreak, misunderstandings, tears, loss, something happened, okay, something definitely happened, spirit clarified death, four of swords, five of cups, With this uh, Knight of Wands energy. Damn. Damn. The moon with the Ten of Swords here. So we know that the moon talks about secret things, hidden things, what's done in the dark. It talks about sneaky, freaky, creepy shit, low down and dirty shit. It talks about shady people and dirty dealings. It talks about criminal activity, moon magic, secrets, witchery, uh, uh, things going on behind the scenes, behind closed doors, behind someone's back late at night in the wee hours of the morning uh it could talk about fear overwhelm dilemmas delays the past the moon has a lot of energy with it but the bottom line is is this is something that was done in secret and there was deception okay because the Ten of Swords talks about a final chapter, a dead end, a breakdown, okay? A break up, somebody being backstabbed, ruined, something hitting rock bottom, failure, okay? The Ten of Swords is betrayal, it's disloyalty, it's sabotage, it's ruin, it's endings, okay? Um, so... This shit that went on, but, how it, but the, the moon also talks about cover-ups, okay? So there was some type of cover-up due to some type of betrayal and sabotage, okay? Like this person died and it was covered up, okay? And this happened at one of these, you know, come-together parties, Okay? Whoever this person was could have also been trafficked there with the promise of, like, money or something. 
if this person was a willing participant, they were trafficked there with the promise of money. Because I keep seeing something about money as well. However, if this person was like a sex slave and sold, um, the money could be just what these persons paid for this person. Um, to, to do what they want to do to this person and have that person trafficked there or what have you. Yeah, because I keep seeing the chariot, the chariot and the nine of coins is at the bottom of the deck here. Okay, so there's definitely some type of trafficking that's going on and a lot of money involved. There's an earth sign woman, Capricorn, Taurus, or Virgo, who's a madam. She's also sexual lovers or partners. She's had sexual relations with, with successful people in power. She could have some type of success, Trump, victory, uh, public recognition herself, but she definitely has sexual relations with persons who do. Okay? But she, she also, she, she, she supplies, she's a mad. She gets paid for, uh, providing like the, some of the victims, the sex slaves, trafficking persons there, luring them to these come together parties, Okay. going on here y'all mm -hmm. this earth sign here was paid a large amount of money you have rewards for your labor yeah there was definitely this 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 queen of pentacles trafficked Whoever this victim was, whoever this person was, and was paid a large amount of money. This person also gets paid a large amount of money for being, like, sexually involved. Because I'm seeing the lovers with the six of wands here, okay? The chariot, the nine of coins, the queen of coins, the lovers, the six of wands, okay? And then with the eight of cups here, this person, like, walked away. Release what didn't serve them, like left this person. Like moved on, let go, like left this person there. Mm -mm. This person could be kind of doing some balancing, acting as well here, okay? Some type of juggling, struggling, prior to, uh, prior to uh, oh my God. Uh, trying to get their priorities straight or in order, okay, making quick decisions financially, okay, because of some type of swift, fast communication, message news, or information, okay, um, going back and forth between this king of wands, okay. So there's our earth sign, female, Capricorn, Taurus, or Virgo, and a fire sign, masculine, Sagittarius, Aries, or Leo, Who is real tight with this King of Cups here? Scorpio, Cancer, Pisces. Uh, uh, oh, shit. Mm -mm. Okay, y'all. There's a lot of money that is made off of this trafficking operation, though, okay? Like, mm -mm. yeah, but this whole situation happened, this, well, this in particular situation, okay? Because I'm pretty sure these type of things happen all the time. 
but this particular situation happened due to there being some type of conflict and defeat, competition, strife, jealousy, and there being some type of betrayal, disloyalty, sabotage, ruin or endings here, okay? In a situation. That's what led to this person getting hurt or dying. Mm -mm. My goodness. Okay. Um, spirit, where do I go from here? Oh my god. Somebody has been picked up and arrested though. Because some type of truth or clarity could be coming out. Due to somebody now being faced with some type of uh, uh, legal problems, legal issues here, okay? With the chariot and the eight of swords here, like that's going on. But there's also these, these sex slaves and victims and things. Some of these people, they're like being like held captive, hostage, like. They just, they there by by force, not by choice. You understand what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Oh goodness. Okay. Uh, let me figure out what else I need to figure out. Okay. Spirit, what else do I need to share with the collective as it relates to the situation? Somebody is a serial killer. Somebody is definitely, somebody involved in this has definitely killed before. Sorry, what else? We got a, a accomplice partner in crime here. So... This serial killer had an accomplice and partner in crime in the death of this person here. They could both be facing justice here. Yeah, I'm seeing man-made disaster here. So this is something that um, didn't happen by accident here, okay? I'm also seeing justice here. I'm seeing this one first, okay? So this serial killer... And their accomplice or partner in crime could be facing uh, some type of legality, something with the justice system being here, okay? But Spirit is saying that this is a man-made disaster here, okay? Yeah, this was definitely a homicide. Somebody is buried somewhere. I'm seeing death, buried. Yeah, this is organized crime as well, Spirit is saying. Okay? Like, this ain't these folks first rodeo. Okay? okay? And I'm going to tell you something else, too. These might be some 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 big cats in the game, baby. But it get, like, this, this rabbit hole goes way deep. This rabbit hole goes way deep, okay? Did these people? I, I know who these people are. Okay, a high priestess just don't. You know what I'm saying? Tell everything that she know. But you need to know that a high priestess holds secret knowledge, secret information, knows occultic knowledge. Okay, so I don't shake and move the way other people carelessly and recklessly shake and move. I don't have to call these people out by name, even though I know their name. That ain't that ain't my job. That's not for me to do. So these people, it would be appalling for the general public to find out that these people are indulged in this, involved in this. Okay. Cause we talking, we talking human trafficking. Money laundering, uh, prostitution, murders, deaths, like all kinds of shit, okay? But, and even though these people are um, wealthy, 
and well known, like baby, this just it, it just barely scratched the surface. What's so fucked up is the race of all these people, cause I know who all these people are and how it's all being put on them to shame they race of people when there are people who way higher than them way wealthier than them who run rule and control all of this shit for even they to be involved in this see that's the type of shit that pisses me off like the whole thing pisses me off you understand what i'm saying because it's a fine line between like if you you grown and you doing grown folk shit and you you freaky and you kinky okay regardless of whether another person see it as right wrong or indifferent if you like threesomes and orgies and sex parties as an adult you can do that but it's a fine line between being a willing participant in adult doing what the fuck you want to do as an adult okay even if you sell an ass for the devil, if you have made a conscientious decision to do that, I wouldn't necessarily promote that. But if you are making a conscientious decision to do that, and I know these people that I'm speaking about in particularly, if one was to do such a thing as that, you would best be in innate position doing that because they get paid a whole hell of a lot doing that. You understand what I'm saying? It's a fine line between that grown adults doing grown full shit whether other people like it or not and it's something else entirely different when you being forced when you being sold pimped out passed around enslaved used abused hurt harm beat neglected unto your death and shit that's that shit I don't like you understand what I'm saying? But the mere fact that I know who these people are, it pisses me off that this shit is solely being exposed amongst their race when I know it's people. I know. There's other, there's other people, not only American and outside their race, but foreign. That is way wealthier than them. That's been doing this shit way longer than them. Who taught. And they are the ones who taught them the game. For them to even be indulged in such a thing. But you don't see them being put on blast. Like this here. This shit is wild. And that's all I'm going to say about that. Here, what other messages? We got regret here, okay? So obviously, persons involved are regret. We got regret in celebrities here, okay? Last well, shit. We also have cult. So these 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 individuals, these wealthy uh, elite uh, individuals belong to some type of dark cult, cabal, secret societies, covens, okay, money. It's all about money. That's what's going on here, y'all. Hold on just a minute. Why is this here? Hold on. Okay, y'all. So, I'm seeing... Um, I'm seeing that this homicide... Th there was a homicide that took place, but this homicide was an assassination. Spirit is in. Okay, this homicide was an assassination. Okay, this was murder. Okay, um, and there's some type of cover up that is going on. I'm also seeing strangulation here. Okay, so somebody something could have got too rough. 
Okay? And this person was strangled to death. Homicide, assassination, strangulation. Okay? And some type of cover up, okay? But it's like these people could be getting caught up about this now like there was like a cover up obviously at the time that this occurred okay because we're talking about something that happened in the past any other messages spirit seeing party here okay so there was some type of party I told you these come together parties, okay? <laughs> it's not funny, but I, I keep hearing this song, okay? What I said, party, I, I literally heard, you got to be good looking because he's so hard to see, yeah. Y'all got to listen to the song. Um, mm -mm. Something's also significant to a fire sign, spouse, or partner. And this water sign. Okay? Now, you remember when that earth, remember when that earth sign woman came out and I said she was like a, she's like a madam or like she gets paid a lot? Um, she's either a madam or she gets paid a lot to attend these parties or to bring others, traffic others to these parties or what have you. The fire sign, remember the king of wands, that fire sign could be her spouse. Because there's something about a fire sign here. That's that king of wands we see. His spouse or partner has a connection to this water sign, which we know is this king of cups here. Mm-mm. We got imprisonment here. There could be people who be going to be like being imprisoned or going to be in prison for this situation. Okay. Somebody could try to fake their death. As well. I'm also seeing mind control here. These people involved are under mind control, Spirit is saying. Mm -hmm. I'm seeing crime of passion. This could have been some type of crime of passion. I'm also seeing missing and perversion here, okay? So this is somebody, whoever the victim is, is somebody who uh, is, is, this person could have been reported as a missing person or somebody who is missing, may have been someone who was kidnapped, abducted, uh, sold into sex slavery, okay? Uh, something about missing. Where the victim is, is, is missing or was reported missing at some point in time. But this was a crime of passion here due to perversion. I'm also seeing drugs and poison here, okay? So there's definitely indulgence in drugs, a poison. Mm -hmm. Damn, I'm seeing revenge, death, couple, greed, male, here. So somebody could have killed this person out of revenge. Their death was caused out of revenge, okay? From a couple, like this couple murdered this person together and this had to do with some type of this had to do with some type of revenge here because of greed okay because of money or something here there's a male who is like greedy in some type of way because we got greed and male here 
I'm literally hearing, I'm hearing, I keep hearing different parts of this song, y'all, okay? In a, per, a certain part of the song, uh, they say, he say, uh, he got funky fingers, he shoots Coca-Cola, he got, or y'all gotta listen to the song here. Whoever this person is shoot, shoots Coke. Like shoots up like cocaine or something. Because that's the part of the song where she say, uh, they say, um, he early warning. He got toe jam football. He got funky fingers. He shoots Coca Cola. Um, he won't mojo filter. Okay. He got hair down to his knees. Say you got to be good looking cause he's so hard to please. Yeah. I'm telling you, y'all gotta listen to this song come together. It's swear to God, it's talking about a fucking orgy. Okay? Um, drug use and some old shit that come together is a bunch of people screwing and coming on each other. They come together, okay? Um, that's what come together me. I know when y'all here come together, you think, oh, it's a, you know, family and friends coming together, loving one another. No, baby, you got to listen to the words that come out their mouth, honey, okay? This is which language is subliminal messages in these songs, okay? I'm trying to tell y'all. Mm -mm. Spirit, any other messages? I'm seeing jealousy here. I'm seeing jealousy in female here. There could have been a female who got jealous. Maybe that they, what, their man was sucking with another man or fucking with somebody else. There was jealousy here or something, okay? This victim, uh, mm hmm this, this victim could have been a female, but it could have been a, um, now I'm hearing rock star lifestyle might not make it. She's so wasted, <laughs> so wasted. Mm -mm. They was wasted, okay? Mm, mm, mm. But there is definitely some type of jealousy that took place. Okay. Mm, mm. I'm also seeing something about a landfill. This person could have been dumped or thrown in a landfill, buried in a landfill, or something. if they weren't just thrown in the ocean but there was definitely um yeah there, there there was definitely a cover up that took place as it relates to the situation spirit what other messages do we need to know somebody is a somebody here involved though is a serial killer okay like they have killed before like this person got bodies okay i'm seeing envy here okay so there's some type of envy or enviousness here. I'm also seeing promiscuous here. Sleeps around. A hot free for all. Sleeps with your man. Somebody is suffering depression. Maybe one of these celebrities are in depression or, okay. 
somebody could be setting the record straight on something or is trying to set the record straight okay keeping you a secret bad choices Somebody could be in depression because they was kicked to the curb in some type of way. I'm seeing toxic. Something is falling apart, falling into pieces. Somebody don't want to hear it. Somebody in their feelings. Somebody don't want to hear something. From somebody that's in their feelings that they have a private relationship with. Mm -hmm. I'm seeing getting played here. Somebody feel like they, some, they, somebody playing them or they get in play here. There's some type of manipulations, lies, and control. Fulfilling fantasy, fulfilling a fantasy. Mm -mm, somebody watching shit go down and enjoying some type of gossip. While somebody else is tired of the drama. Something is destroyed, shattered, broken, fucked up in some type of way. I'm seeing game over at the bottom of the deck with sex shop. Mm -mm. Game over sex shop copycat. Check yourself, police, fake friends. Somebody definitely got fake friends here. I'm seeing divorce here. Somebody somebody that's involved in this, this married could be going through a divorce right now or getting a divorce or this could be this also says breaking a contract here. Somebody could have broke some type of contract. Mm -hmm. Someone who is emotionally intelligent yet is a hater is burning evidence of some kind. They're keeping a promise to somebody and burning some type of evidence. Somebody offered, somebody could have offered a fake apology as well here. This person is wearing a mask. They're not who they appear to be. They're cloaking themselves. They're hiding who they truly are with this fake apology here because they got caught, huh? I'm seeing caught, huh? Finding evidence, getting caught, cheating, or what have you. Fake apologies. It's the only reason why this person came with this fake apology here because of recording here. Something that was recorded, Okay. Yeah, something about getting a room, motel, uh, hotel, motel, suite, business, pleasure here. Betrayal, deceit, backstab, traitor, not to be trusted. Sexual protection, a situation is about to explode, shit's about to pop off up in flames. Mm -mm. Bottom of the deck, we got game over here. so there was definitely like this this has to do with like i said some type of pleasure in 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 one of these uh damn come together sessions they be having this is a situation that happened in the past okay there was some type of jealousy okay but now a situation has come to like game over okay <clears throat> as it relates uh to this 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 situation here okay i feel like several of these people involved though belongs to some type of cult like a, it's like a satanic cult here okay so we got gossip here there's definitely a lot of gossip that is going on that's going around let me pull these real quick here okay yeah, I'm seeing secrets here. Some type of secrets could be being exposed in some type of way as it relates to these people. Especially if somebody has gotten arrested or something like that. Okay. So, um, this has something to do with somebody in power. Somebody with a position of authority, fame, or recognition who abuses their power. This person could also be losing their power as well with this loss of power being here, okay? I'm seeing brainwashing being here. This person is under mind control like a mug, okay? Um, 
some type of brainwashing, mind control, uh, or something that's going on here. What is this five of coins energy? Why is this person... So, like I said, this has to do with a murder. This person... Damn, I'm seeing murder, technology, and alternative uh, sexuality here. Damn, with ritual sacrifice here, okay? So, this has to do with the murder this, that this person recorded that was found here, okay? This is like a snuff film. When you record somebody being abused and murdered on camera, it's a snuff film. With this alternative sexuality here, okay? Somebody could be... Uh, any one of the sexuals, okay, gay, bisexual, uh, somebody could be uh, 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 polygamous, okay, this says polygamous, Casanova, sexual minority, asexual, bisexual, any type of sexual, okay, but we got a ritual sacrifice here, human sacrifice, okay, that's what this is all about. But this murder was like recorded here. Spirit is saying. Mm -mm. Shit. Mm -mm. Got the devil here. Okay. So this person who had literally went from wealth to worry, ten of pentacles to five of pentacles, like I told you, this person saw they sold to the devil a long time ago. They chained to the devil, bound to the devil. They are shepherd for the devil, okay? They are puppet on the string, period, um, for the satanic powers that be. That's the reason why they had the mercy of the man, okay? The powers that be. This person is heavily into the dark arts, okay? This person is demonically possessed. They're cursed, okay? Uh, yeah. Very clarify this two of swords here. Two of swords. This person is heavily in magic. Heavy in magic. Okay. Yeah, when this person went to them crossroads and saw they saw um this because of follow with the fall of civilization here, this is about greed, corruption, indulgence, and ignorance here. Okay. This person wanted power. They wanted fame, they wanted fortune, they wanted recognition, okay? And this person, they didn't they, they got in collaborations and contractual agreements. They sold they sold, they sold their ass. They didn't give a damn who they had to they didn't give a damn how they had to lie, cheat, steal, who they had to kill, or what they had to do to get the fame, fortune, and recognition that they got, okay? But when they got that position of authority, they abused their power. And this is the reason why this person is losing power. Spirit is saying. Okay? Um, seven of coins here, Spirit. Okay? Yeah, this person belongs to a secret society as well. Okay? This person may be, this person is a Freemason, Spirit is saying. The secret society card, they, they belong to multiple different. It's interesting. This person is involved in a lot. This person could be a mason. But this card says secret society, okay? Like, I'm not making it up, just saying some shit, just being malicious, cruel. This card literally says um, secret society, and it has the the the, the uh, masonic uh, symbolism on here. And the first thing up here is Freemason. But it also says Rosicrucian, Cremora, or other type of secret society. This person is a, it's pretty told me this person is a Mason, though, okay? They may be a 33rd degree Mason, okay? But they're definitely a Mason, okay? Um, this person also has ties to, like, uh, like, this person is a part of, like, this secret society, as well as cults, covens, um, uh, the cabal, okay, the black boule, okay, um, this person is deep in some shit, okay, um, this person also has ties to human trafficking, sex trafficking, prostitution rings, sex rings, drug trafficking, this person is a, is, is a lot, okay, but Spirit is saying this person is a swindler, 
okay? They are swindler. They are perpetrated as being exposed because they are swindler, okay? And they're trying to evade capture in some type of way, Spirit is saying. Like I said, this person is heavily indulged in magic because this person is actually a warlock. This person is a high-ranking, like, sorcerer, Spirit is saying, okay? This person could be an alchemist into alchemy. This person is definitely illusionist, okay? Could be into Wiccan uh, or what have you. But this person definitely practiced the dark arts, okay? Um, shit. This person may end up being imprisoned, okay? I'm seeing imprisonment and banishment here, okay? So this person may end up being jailed or imprisoned here. They may end up being, like, banished, exiled, shunned, disowned, or forced underground as well, Spirit is saying. That could be the judgment, yeah, I'm also seeing something here with oppression, though, okay? I'm telling you, there are people who are wealthy. This this man is wealthy, but there are trust people who are way wealthier than this person, okay? That really run, ruling, control shit, okay? That is like still uh, with this oppression card here, still oppressing this person in some type of way. Because with this brainwashing being here and oppression, this motherfucker is under mind control. They still being this person. I don't. I don't give a damn how what they in, what set they claim. Okay, how much money they got? They has to still be in control. Okay, period. Point blank. Okay, but this situation has caused destruction here. Okay. This person could be seen as a destroyer, a sabotager, a fool. Okay? I feel like this person getting caught up has a lot of people caught up, okay? Like, this is like, this is like, shit. This is like neck and neck with Epstein, but it's coming off like it's even worse than Epstein. It's like a lot of the same thing, but even worse. Because y'all got to see, Lily, like even when they said, you know... The shit came out, you know, all down them lists and different shit came out with, you know, you know, Epstein and Lolito Express and Epstein Island and all that shit or whatever. You got to remember that the only thing that came out about him was basically like, uh, you know, trafficking allegations and, um, you know, uh, like, I don't know, like some like, I don't know, it's like what it's called exactly like, you know, briberies and, and like, you know. Whatever the money transactions, however that go, whatever that's called or whatever. But mainly the only thing that came out about Epstein was the fact that there was like, uh, he had a lot of connections with a lot of wealthy people who was going over to this little private island where these, you know, where, you know, these sex parties was going on and there was trafficking and different things. That was all. You understand what I'm saying? This shit here, we talking about murders. Human trafficking. Sex trafficking, sex rings, okay, prostitution, drug trafficking, you know what I'm saying, like, a lot more shit. So, technically, even if Epstein was indulged in some of those other things, too, all of that shit didn't come out on Epstein. They making all this shit come out on these persons here, though. Okay? And ain't no, y'all need to understand the difference in shit. Even when when speaking of the law and like charges and shit, ain't no fucking uh, 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 statute of limitations on fucking murder. You understand what I'm saying? And you done recorded the shit. You just you just got snuff lambs laying around. And it's been confiscated. Like, like, come on. Gossip. It's a lot of gossip. A lot of talk. Going on. 
as it relates to this shit. What else is going on? What else is going on? Somebody, uh, somebody playing in dark magic. Somebody is stressed over this situation, Spirit is saying. The wicked around you are wearing a mask. This person has popularity, or these persons involved have popularity, okay? Um, Spirit, what else is going on? Mm -hmm. I'm seeing suicided by the enemy. Somebody overdosed here. Okay. Uh, but this is a murder, though. If that's a situation that not happened, I, I seen suicide when I was shuffling those other cars. Somebody here that may be involved, like y'all may hear of a celebrity or somebody wealthy, uh, of wealthy status, who gonna pop up dead and they gonna make it seem like, they, they may make it seem like this person overdosed or this person's gonna be suicided by the enemy. It's actually gonna be murder unless it's a situation that already happened, okay? Um, but if that was the case, you, we would have known about whoever died a long time ago, okay? But somebody is going to be, somebody involved in this, okay, is going to wind up suicided by the enemy, okay, by way of overdose, okay? But it's actually murder here. Some type of initiation went on the night that this person died or the situation happened. There was definitely human trafficking. Um. Uh, what I tell y'all? <laughs> party, 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 let's all get wasted. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Some type of initiation was going on that night, okay? There was definitely uh, human trafficking involved. Yeah. Somebody was in critical condition or winds up in critical condition, okay? Got powerful business moguls involved. Um, I keep seeing birthday celebrations, so it could have been like a birthday celebration or something that was going on the night of this in particular party here. I feel like these people may have gatherings, get-togethers, and parties and different things like all the time or what have you. But, uh, like, it could have been some type of, uh, like, birthday celebration that night. But some type of initiation went on with someone here, okay? Uh, it is tied to this human trafficking here. So, we got fake friends here. A lot of these people, uh, you know, are fake friends with one another. And that's what, like, interests me with wealthy people. Which I, I guess is like something they just kind of have to roll the dice on or whatever because birds of a flock feather flock together. You understand what I'm saying? So, but it amazes me how comfortable these people get. You understand what I'm saying? I don't care who you are, how much money you got, what your position title or role is. I don't trust nobody. Okay? Trust is proven. I don't care who you are. Okay? You can be sophisticated, educated, illuminated, have degrees and some more shit. That don't mean I'm supposed to trust you. You understand what I'm saying? But it's like, it, it amazes me with wealthy people how comfortable they get with one another. And I think a lot of them feel like, uh, you know, I'm rich, you rich. We are part of the same uh, circle. We in the same secret society. We are part of the same cult. We in this game together. So they get comfortable with one another and think like when it comes to like, you know, they low down dirty doings and the shenanigans that they got going on behind the scenes, that everything can stay cool and kosher and covered up and hidden and secret and on down low and all this other kind of shit. But then when like shit pop off, it's like, it's like, they all got fucking snakes. In, I mean, like anaconda-ass fucking snakes swimming in their own swamps. You understand what I'm saying? 
It be the very motherfuckers that they, they work with, they was cool with, they teamed up, linked up with, and, and different things that when shit hit the fan and pop off, be the very ones that like either set them up in some type of fucking way, get them caught up in some type of way, and you know what I'm saying, they end up having this, you know, bitter bitch face like what the fuck but it's like why the hell did you even trust them in the first place you understand what i'm saying and you see it amongst like it's not even just say like celebrities like it could be wealthy people period even like uh wealthy elite government officials and different things okay they put a lot of trust and from the assistants to people, just people uh, uh, who are like higher ranking, but on a lower level than say the position that they have that work with them on a daily fucking basis. You know what I'm saying? And 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 and, and these folks around them, you know, technically, you know, a person can play like they're your friend, play like they're your lover, play like they're your partner your confidant and this, that, and the other and collecting information and data and all other kind of shit on you. You know what I'm saying? The whole fucking time. And, and, and stashing this shit in some little fucking insurance folder for them in case some shit pop off to say they ass while your ass go crumbling like a fucking cookie and going down. You know what I'm saying? Like, that shit is crazy, okay? Um, And it just seems to, um, it, 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 it just amazes me. Okay, because and, and the reason why it amazes me because if these people were, I, I don't even want to say poor, you know what I'm saying? But if they lived like if they were poor or if they lived the lifestyle of say just regular everyday average Joe people, okay, anywhere from middle class to lower, what is called lower class, they would not be so comfortable. In entrusting the people that they entrusting, but I feel like they automatically assume that they can trust one another because they are all say a part of the same shit and this, that, and the other or whatever. And you know they have they inside jokes and inside secrets amongst each other that say the general public don't know about. So this is just stay amongst us, but it don't it don't it don't stay that way. That's how I know, like, like a lot of people, they be like, like, when it comes, like, when the masses find out about some shit, when the general public find out about some shit, you know what I'm saying, people take that shit and they run with it and they be all up in arms about, you know, the latest gossip that was going on with celebrities such and such and government officials such and such and wealthy elites such and such or what have you, but y'all need to understand. See, I peaked this shit a long time ago. Them folks, especially all of them together, you, we talking about millionaires and billionaires and fucking trillionaires and shit. They got enough money for the masses, for the general public not to know shit that has anything to do with them. So if you do hear something, you know what I'm saying, radical, blasphemous, outrageous, preposterous about them, baby, that shit is a set up from fucking high up. Okay? I don't know which one of the 13 fucking bloodlines at the tip top of the fucking pyramid you pissed the fuck off. But that set up came from way the fuck up there. Okay? You talking about set ups amongst fucking goddamn me fucking uh uh hell I don't know like uh fucking Jesuits and in and, and skulls and bones and fucking knights and templars and and, 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 and and shit. You understand what I'm saying? You talking about set ups from 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 uh uh big banksters that you don't even never see in public. Who got connections to the mobs and the cartels and different shit or whatever. And that shit just trickle on down the line of persons in power and different shit. I be looking at this shit. Because I'm telling you, out of all of them together, they got enough fucking wealth for the general fucking public. All oh, mind control, brainwash, dumb down. Ass. So when you find out about something, okay? Majority of the shit, y'all need to understand. 
that the shit that the general public see, hear about, find out about is broke down into two different categories. Either entertainment or fucking distraction. Okay? But when this major type of shit come out like this, this be set up from fucking high up. I don't know what the hell you'd have said, what you did, what you'd have been asked of, that you reneged on or refused to fucking do, or who you'd have pissed off amongst the 13 fucking bloodlines at the tip top of the fucking pyramid. But this is when you see this shit here. And for folks to act like they so goddamn all seeing, all knowing, okay, sophisticated, educated, illuminated, and all of this shit, you would think that folks will have enough common sense not to get in bed with these people, not to play the game with these people, not to get in fucking collaborations and contracts with these goddamn people, and then uh, uh, do stupid shit. Because should some shit pop off at the end of the day, they will let your ass crash and fucking burn before the hell they will. Every fucking time. But it amazes me how often they try to put uh uh um uh 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 put the, the put a uh, uh, a face of color on shit. When they, we know that there are way wealthier people who are high up in power. I'm talking about the folks that make the money, that own the banks, that, that control the Federal the fuck Reserve, and every fucking thing else, bruh. That makes this mirror go round, go round. You understand what I'm saying? But they stay be trying to put a face, and this could be a a, 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 a a face of color of any color. I ain't just talking about black people. You could be black, Latina. You can be uh, Haitian, Jamaican, Asian. You could be in the damn thing you want to be. You got some color in the damn skin. All kinds of shit will fall down upon people every fucking time. A folk with color to their skin. And that's what you get to see in the humiliation rituals and 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 just, you know, the smear camp and every fucking thing. But we know. Y'all need to understand the people, look, let me tell you something. The people here is some fucked up shit here. The people here are wealthy. Indulge in some fucked up shit. Okay? But the people who are... Human trafficking is a billion dollar fucking operation. It's damn near making more money than drug trafficking is. Do you honestly think that even these people who are wealthy is making the most wealth off of this here operation. That's all I'm saying. Okay? And then a lot of people don't look at shit in a whole. I look at everything. The if, the ands, the buts, the maybes, the possibilities, and some more shit too. When you see people and they ain't about that life. They wasn't about that life before they got rich and famous. You ain't never ever wondered why it is the, the, the shit that people get caught up with when they was broke. They wasn't doing that type of shit. They wasn't getting caught up in that type of shit. It wasn't until you got, and then you have to ask yourself, who in the fuck gets rich and famous, has fortunes, don't want for nothing, and then decide to be a criminal? That's learned fucking behavior. That means somebody higher than them, richer than them, bigger than them, taught them the shit that they are being put on blast for doing right the fuck now. Yet you don't see them motherfuckers' faces in the goddamn news, in the media, or nothing. I got a problem with that. I got a problem with that. 
Why? Because I'm telling you why. It's easy enough to say, look, say a serial killer got caught today. It's easy enough to look at that serial killer and say, oh, this old low down, dirty motherfucker. You a serial killer. You've been going around here killing people all up and down the highways and the byways. Okay. I get it. But who raped that serial killer? Who showed that serial killer how to rape? Who showed that serial killer how to be a fucking sad, uh, sadist? Who showed that serial killer, huh, how to be a fucking cannibal? Or any damn thing he else he into, that don't nobody care. Ain't nobody gonna go back to that. Ain't nobody gonna do nothing about that. All you know is right now, this damn serial killer here, that being caught, you all filthy, nasty, low down, dirty ass serial killer. You know what I mean? Caught for killing people. And your ass gonna go down because you kills people. But what about the killers that taught that killer how to kill? And every damn thing y'all see part of and do. You understand what I'm saying? That's all I'm saying. CIA, FBI government, okay? It's involved, obviously, with what's going on here. I'm seeing evil serial killer family. Somebody having sleepless nights. Wealthy white privilege, abuse of power, and racist discrimination. Mm -mm. I ain't one to gossip, so you ain't heard that from me. Mm -mm. It's over, it's over now. Move over, your game shut down. Sorry. Mm -mm. Big bad bullies. I'm seeing sex workers selling ass for the devil. Any other messages here? I'm seeing thriller Halloween night. Could this, ooh, oh. Did this situation happen on Halloween night at a Halloween party that someone was having? Spirits say they're dangerous. Cause this is mm -mm, somebody is cutthroat and ruthless. Spirits say don't think it's a game when it's really not. Wanna be players whispering sweet nothings in your ear. Somebody vanished without a trace into thin air, missing, disappeared. Mm -hmm. Y'all like, share, and subscribe. Okay, this is gonna be a long one. Crime, uh, crime of passion. It's no coincidence that if this is going on or being talked about or happening right now here, we are smack dead in the middle of election time. I tell y'all all the damn times, pay attention. Every election, it be a lot of shit that go down during elections, okay? Mass shootings, all kind of Hollywood scandals, okay? All kind of staged events and, 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 and false flags and all kinds of shit. Oh, I've been telling y'all, I told y'all a long time ago. Y'all gonna learn to listen to me. I ain't got no reason to make it up, okay? This shit could be centered around some type of election fraud going on or happening. I'm seeing ridicule and judgment here. Spirits say, listen to the words that come out of their mouth. 
the freaks come out at night. Somebody on the verge of giving up. I'm seeing fire sign, air sign. Fire, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Fire sign. Oof. Wait a minute. There's a fire sign, air sign involved. There could be a fire sign, air sign couple. I'm seeing sex with me so amazing. Acting a fool. Spirit, what else is going on? What else is going on with the situation? I'm seeing something. Uh, I just seen terrorist attack and hijack plane. Okay, so if like this situation here is so big, okay, um, if this is about who I think it's about. Or what I think it's about, okay, or no, it's about. They could cause another to strike. Like a lot of people is playing, paying attention to the situation here, okay. There could be uh, uh, like some type of diversion or uh, or a decoy or some type of uh, distraction that happens in an effort to try to detour people. From a situation here, okay? They might have something to do with a terrorist attack or threat. Or something to do with a hijack plane, which could go hand in hand or could be something separate. It's devil, we got devil worshippers here. Okay. Spirit, what else is going on? I'm seeing death here. So there was a death that, that took place. Don't push me because I'm close to the edge. Okay. Ooh, I'm seeing these hoes don't have no home training, superstars, celebrity, Hollywood scandals, insane twists. There's going to be some type of insane twist to this situation. Game over. Secret society here. Illuminati, Freemason, friends or associates here. Danger, disaster, and destruction here. Somebody tried to frame somebody for a crime that they committed. So, mm, mm. somebody's trying to frame somebody for a crime that they committed, okay? Guys, remember me when, remember when I told you that this, 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 this water sign came out as the filmmaker he's the one that recorded something he was there you know whatever type of coming together situation you know uh you know whole oasis that was going on sexual escapade or whatever but i think it was actually the the air sign that actually killed this person but they were all there together okay and I feel like they all did something together. But it was the water sign that was that recorded the situation. But I think it was the air sign that actually killed this fire sign. And there's more than one fire sign here. Because I know y'all 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 heard me speak of a fire sign with the earth sign. I feel like they are just like either good friends with these other persons involved, they have like friendship, connection, communication, whatever they deal is or whatever. 
I believe those just extra people that's like, you know, I don't know if they was there that night or like they may have been there that night or whatever happened. They, 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 they got a bond. They're close in some type of way. But there's another fire sign that died on that night. Okay? So say, 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 uh, just throwing it out here. Say this, this water sign. Okay, well, forget that. Somebody, say somebody has been arrested, okay, or under investigation for what's going on here. Been arrested, being questioning. Maybe they're trying to put this person's death on one person, but it's actually, and they were there. They are accomplice. They are a partner in the crime, but they may not have been the one that, like, you know, uh, delivered the final blow, basically, to what caused this person's death. You understand what I'm saying? I hope that makes sense. Okay? Say you got, say, um, I don't want to put y'all in the middle of, like, but say, say you got, like, three people. And they have a threesome with each other. And one of the people, like, uh, you may have gave this person a drink, gave this person some drugs or whatever, got them high, got them, you know, on that level, okay? And say, uh, y'all all got down with the get down together, right? Or all three of them people got down with the get down together, okay? And say, uh, maybe an argument, a fight, or... Or some type of jealousy altercation happen, or either say the situation got too rough and say the other person strangled this person to death. This person ended up dead. Okay? It wasn't the person that gave them the drugs or the, the, the too much drugs or the alcohol or whatever that killed them. It was the other person. They was all having a threesome together. It was the other person that was in on the threesome that said, deliver the final blow or say the strangle. They strangling this person to death, getting too rough with this person. You know, whatever the situation that happened, okay, and killing this person. And then after this situation happened, them two people work together to cover this situation up. But that, that, that person who was, rec say, recording and say, invited this person over, gave this person drink and drugs and uh, indulged with sex with this person, everything else, say they not the person that delivered the final blow that killed this person here. I feel like this is what this is about. They tried to frame you. They're trying to frame you for a crime that you didn't commit here, okay? Which is like, like, this, like, so somebody may say be guilty of going to this little come together session little freak uh you know little sex party whatever you want to call it okay partaking in uh human trafficking sex trafficking prostitution sex ring uh operations or whatever you want to call it getting high drinking everything else that could have been going on at this function they even had sex which say this sex slave, okay? But they might not have been the person that killed them, okay? Just imagine yourself and and uh, again caught up and 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 it's a list of charges, and one of the charges is murder, but you wasn't involved in that murder. You understand what I'm saying? We got ops here, okay? So this like somebody. Somebody is an op. Somebody is an informant. Somebody is an informant. Somebody a stalker, low down and dirty, a sellout, a savage, a con. They full of deception, an agent. Somebody is an informant. Somebody is feeding information to the feds or the CIA about these people, about this situation or something here. I'm also seeing hypocrites. I'm seeing family crime mob. Plots, plans, and schemes. It ain't nothing to cut that bitch off. Karmic lover and friends. Water sign, earth sign. Freaky fetish. Black magic. Mr. Casanova, a rapist. 
assassination of a public figure. There could be a public figure that's involved in this that's going to be assassinated. Okay, and 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 that's the that's who Spirit is saying is 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 Mr. Casanova. He's a rapist. Mr. Casanova is a rapist. Is going to be assassinated. He's a public figure that's going to be assassinated. He a Mr. Casanova that's a rapist. Mm -mm, satanic sellouts cover up murder by numbers they try to recruit you against your real somebody trying to find a way out they playing in dark magic to harm you somebody's mad you rejected them set up somebody is a hypnotist an illusionist uh into voodoo satanism somebody's very evil wicked something's on a dark web Sick Satanists, scandalous, abusing their power and authority to manipulate uh, and control others, controlling narcissists, mind control, opt, brainwash. Okay, hold on. Mind control, brainwash, op, being coached and groomed, organized crime, frauds, fakes, and imposters. Again, they lied and tried to set you up on a crime. Cloning lab. One of these celebrities involved could be a clone, boy. They smile in your face all the while they want to take your place. Those backstabbers. Low down and dirty shame. Somebody got a karmic mother or father. Mm -mm. Spirits say these clowns way too cocky. Billy badass bullies, soulless beings, wolves and snakes in sheep's clothing. The rabbit hole goes deep, two-faced. Corruption within the government. Blackmail. Mm -mm. If there's an earth sign that is good, if there's an earth sign that is involved in this, or is like, um, I feel like there's an earth sign. Like other people could be getting hands up for this, but there's going to be an earth sign that may get called to court or something. Or something about a lost court case with the earth sign as it relates to the situation. So I don't know if they like, I don't know, like call this person a court, like something here, but something about a lost court case. Yeah, don't trust them. Watch your surroundings. Targeted individual, somebody's a mm, mm, child killer, swift communication, shapeshifters, satanic ritual abuse, revenge, secret witches and warlocks in secret societies, crooked government officials. Mm -mm. They get mad and hate you when they can't control and manipulate you for their own ill will. Abuse mentally, physically, emotionally, sexually, psychologically, double crossers. Mm -mm, illegal harassment. There's a masculine here who is overly aggressive and mean to women, but they talk sweet to other men. Yeah, that's the person that's a strong crackhead. This person shoot up Coca Cola, like I said. Breaking news. This may make breaking news. Mm -mm. Spirit, any other messages? They're attacking you out of hate. Sex magic. Casting spells on you. Got witches and warlocks. Dark priests and priestess. Uh, sorcerers and sorceress. Abusing their power and their gifts. There's a masculine involved who's a down low brother that's a part of this. He in a sunken place right now. This is a part of some type of agenda. You got bloodthirsty human blood drinkers. Scammer, exposed, con artist. Drug dealers with bad intentions, hating on me, satanic cult. Suspicious activity, something, something just ain't right. Animal sacrifice. Something could have been a gang. Uh, what is it? Uh, something could have been a gang. There could have been a gang bang. 
or something on this person. Human sex trafficking, hate, shicey individuals in on the setup, black wicked witches. There's something being hidden, liars, cheaters, and thieves abusing their money, power, privilege, and authority to bully others into submission. Work, work, work. Yep, somebody's death was staged to look like an overdose. Ten of Swords here. Cruelty, sabotage, disloyalty, betrayal, deception, hate crime, backstab, evil, ruin, fatal endings. Mm -mm, spirits say they're going to pay with their life for what they've done. Any other messages, spirit? Oh, one of these men involved here, mother set them up to hide what she did to you. Your mother set you up to hide what she did to you. So your mother could be the mole, could be the informant, could be the rat. If any one of these persons involved have been arrested, their mother set them up to hide what they did to them. Your mother is the mole, is the rat. They thought you were slow, dumb, and stupid, but you're not. Spirits say don't overreact. Mm -mm, this person, oh shit. This person gonna pop off. I probably shouldn't even told them then, honey, if they listening to me. When this person gonna pop off, okay? Gonna lose all control when they find out their mama is the one that set them up. Um, yeah, she a murderous black widow. Somebody's mother is a murderous black widow. Your mother set you up to hide what she did to you, but she's she's already a murderous black widow, okay? So if your your father is deceased or something like that, it's because of your mother. Yeah. Somebody's mother is the queen of voodoo. Who do she do? Okay? Yeah, addictions. Sex, drugs, alcohol, gambling, porn, toxicity. Spirit say them folks ain't right. Black on black crime. Our lives don't matter amongst our own kind. There's a narcissist that need help. Soulless beings demonically possessed. Devil in the blue dress. There's a devil in the blue dress and this bitch carried poison on her. Kidnapper, abductor. Family secrets. Shh. Manipulation. Somebody mean and surly. If this water sign, if this is about this water sign, if this water sign person who I think it is has been apprehended and arrested, your mama set you up to hide what she did to you. She a whole op. She an informant. She a snitch to say herself and keep money coming in for her goddamn self. Why she throw you under the goddamn bus when she know good damn hell well she involved in this shit, okay? And in a uh, uh, a predator, a madam, and some more shit. And the bitch is a uh, is a um, she a liar, a cheater, a thief, okay? And she a murderous black widow. Mm -mm. Yep, sell out, stepping and fetching for the man. They're about to get locked up, Spirit is saying. The Empress here. So this man, ooh, this person's mama could be about to get locked up too. Because I'm telling you, she's in on this shit. And she a madam. She's a, she's an enabler. Dis mm -mm. Discrimination. Mm -mm. Somebody gonna be triggered. Okay, we got a trigger here. This could be a triggered attack, trigger terrorism, trigger fight, trigger division, trigger racism, trigger violence, trigger discrimination, trigger murder, triggered hate, trigger riots. Okay, yeah, if somebody is a psychotic narcissist. Spirit, any other messages? That's a damn shame. So I'm seeing heartache and pain here. Your mama ain't got no love for you. 
somebody's mama is a hating ass bitch. I swear. Ooh. Mm -mm, y'all look. Look at her. Okay. This is <laughs> this some whole ass shit here, bro. I'm telling you. Any one of these people that get caught up, okay? You all of a sudden on the investigation, uh, being interrogated, being arrested. Your hating ass bitch of a mother set you up to hide what she did to you. She is the mole. She is the op. She's the goddamn informant. She 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 sold her soul to the devil a long time ago. You already know because she, she involves in this shit. She's a fucking madam. This bitch is in on this human trafficking and every fucking thing. She's a black fucking widow. Especially if you if you got a if any one of your your mother's exes died, that bitch did it. If any one of your mothers your like your father or some shit, that bitch did it. Okay? I'm trying to tell you. But this shit here, nigga, I'm trying to tell you. She the all. She the all. And she gonna get every fucking body caught up. Because she the all. The enemy big man. Sacrifice. Witch coven rituals. Toxic family members. Can't trust nobody. These fools sick to death for real. Backroom deals going on. Blood sacrifice. Secret hidden camera. These wanksters need to stop fronting. Mm -mm. Someone put a spell on you. Wicked witches. Envy. Lies and deception. Mm -mm. You got somebody involved here. Your girlfriend. Whoever your girlfriend. A side piece was or whatever. There was some type of lies and deceptions. From this person as well. Maybe they in on. Some shit. Okay. I can't do nothing but read what comes out here. Okay. Spirits say stay woke. They be creeping. Dishonesty and trickery from someone you thought was a friend. Oh, somebody is a cannibal, con artist, a murder took place. Your entire family is in on the setup. Mm -mm. The sellouts are all around you. Ugliness in their hearts, drug addiction, trauma forced upon you. Somebody is using magic to control your free will. Hidden enemies, control freaks. Which doctor, higher ups, pulling the strings of all the puppets. I'm also seeing heavy burdens here. Somebody dealing with some heavy burdens. Okay. I'm seeing very important person here. Stay awoke, stay aware, stay prepared, stay protected. Whoever that very important person is that maybe be con that could be connected to the situation. Spirits say evil is as evil does. Toxicity. Spirit, any other messages? Is you rolling? Bitch, I might be. Somebody like popping pills. Girl, he geeked up. Girl, he geeked up. Y'all haters want to see you in poverty. Oh, shit. The whole family in on it. Jealousy, premeditated murder. Manipulative narc is an emotional abuser. Organ harvesting. Fake phony Christians. A deal with the devil don't last. Mm -mm. This world is run, ruled, and controlled by hate, racism, discrimination, sex, violence, and Satanism. I'm watching you here. So somebody is watching watching somebody here. Any other messages? Hypocrites in the church. Mm -mm, Decepticons going to jail. This was a setup gone wrong. Betrayal for the love of money. Illuminati trying to initiate you, suffering in silence, boyfriends, lying politicians. The information is leaving someone shook, corrupt cops, mother murderous madness. Mm -mm. Is there any other messages?
any other messages here? All somebody, I'm seeing conflicts and battles here. All somebody is worried about is they needs being met. They really don't care about nothing else. Somebody's stunned and fronting. There's competing conflicts, fighting, fussing, cussing, arguments, hating, and disagreements. Okay. Mm -mm. Dirty detectives. They're afraid of you. Family secrets. Mm -mm. Okay, y'all. That's what's going on here. Okay. Mm -mm. Somebody need to be careful though Like if they, they are in association With people that's involved with this Or they're, if they're in, involved with this But they like are still like, like free Or what have you Be careful because somebody's trying to catfish you With somebody in particular It could be like uh, an informant, a, 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 a plant, a spy or some shit or, you know what I'm saying? Doing some type of secret investigations or something um, as it relates to this, this, this stuff here, okay? I'm seeing cross-dressers. Somebody is a cross-dresser or likes cross-dressing. Spirits say these folks is uh, willing slaves. Mm -mm. Yeah, this got to do with a prostitution ring. Willing slaves. You can't trust your own family for whoever involved in this. Okay, they don't care about us. Your mama been casting spells on you. You think you know someone until you find out their evil was hidden. Smoke a little bit, drink a little bit, getting fucked up. Any other messages, spirit? Sellouts don't work for God. They're shepherds for the devil. This situation has caused some type of uh, destruction in some type of way. She or he is so cold-hearted, okay? Whoever's involved in this situation is cold-hearted. Mm -mm. Any other messages, Spirit? Any other messages? I don't know why I keep seeing something about human experimentation, okay? I'm also seeing caution beware here. Somebody is dealing with mental conflict or is in mental conflict. Somebody ain't nothing but a gold digger. We got satanic powers that be. They can no longer control you. Got important information. Life changes here. There's some type of surprise. Domestic abuse. Mentally ill individuals. Mentally unstable individuals, denial, delusions, decisions, and deceptions, dangers, disasters, and uh, destructions. Heavy burdens. So there's suspicious, there's a whole lot of damn suspicious activity, but this has suspicious activity. Uh... Questioning someone's motive. Somebody having unsure thoughts. It's too risky. Stay ready so you ain't got to get ready. Somebody needs to let it go. Looks like another love TKO. Some type of spells are backfiring as well, guys, okay? So I'm going to wrap it up there, okay? Uh, we are already over two hours in. Um, as it relates to this messages, honey, I hope this is giving you all the truth and the clarity um, that you were seeking pertaining to a situation I hope y'all not dealing with, but it seems that other people are dealing with, okay? Um, but that's what's going on here, y'all. Okay, so um, 
Y'all, this 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 energy just came out of nowhere, honey. Okay, like y'all see me shuffle every darn card. Okay, I'm not scripted in no type of way, honey. I'm not being paid to say this, that, and the third or nothing. Okay, I just feel like maybe it's what's in the energy um, right now or what have you, and these the messages that comes out. Okay, I'm led by spirit, so you know whatever messages spirit give me, then those are the messages that I relate to you all. Um, of course, I will do another reading for you all later that would likely align more with the, the general public collective, okay, that y'all could uh, possibly resonate with, okay, but yeah, um, it's just a lot of goings on right now with a whole lot of things, honey, okay, um, and so it seems that this is like overwhelmingly in the energy um spirit is saying okay but that situation like i feel like this situation can go either way here i definitely know whoever this water sign masculine is definitely i feel like he he may record all of these gatherings these these come together sessions or what have you okay either he was responsible for killing this victim and and the other person was just there and maybe they covered it up together or either the other person was or what have you but i mean it really don't much matter um especially if the situation was recorded in the first place then i then it should you know and, and if authorities have it then they should obviously be able to see who actually uh killed this person but it's just it's it's amazing it's amazing how this shit is going on but it's like somebody it's like somebody it almost feels like somebody's trying to shift blame on somebody else um as to to who actually did the killing here and it's interesting because i feel like that's the person that spirit is seeing is a serial killer that person has killed other persons before Okay, and it's like that person is like involved in the death of this person or whatever, but it's like they're trying to, even though they like caught up or some shit, they're trying to shift the blame to make it seem like it was, you know what I'm saying, another person or what have you that actually did the killing or whatever, but it was like you was there, you recorded it, and you know, this, that, and the third or what have you. But, um, at the end of the day, I think uh, in a situation like that, it's one of those things where if you, you know, kind of like if you and your friend, you know, go to the bank and, uh, you, you know, you, you know, y'all going to rob the bank and you driving the car and only one of y'all going there to rob the bank, you know, y'all get caught up. Y'all both going to go down for robbing the bank. You know what I'm saying? But, um. That's what's going on, y'all, okay? But it's just like, it's a whole lot of other goings on as well, okay? So, hopefully this gave y'all the information that y'all needed. I'm not messy like some other people. I don't shake it. I feel like it's the right way and the wrong way to do anything. You understand what I'm saying? Uh, with my free speech, as you can see here, I can talk about whatever I want to talk about under the sun. You understand what I'm saying? But like I said, it's the right way and the wrong way. A uh, sophisticated way, a classy way, a uh, uh, intelligent way to to talk about these things and to um, discuss these things, okay? Uh, without having to slander people's name publicly, and you just got some ignorant, messy people um, who just kind of do that or whatever. However, if something has been even named, certain names being called, when things have been made public information then you know it's kind of like you know open season it's free reign um for you to use that in in such a manner as well okay but like the the situation is so in depth um that still only could be applied to what's being said um in said news article or news segment or station or what you understand what i'm saying so, like, say, Epstein, for instance, we know that, you know, it was, like, the uh, the trafficking uh, situations and different things that were said about him. But, say, if I decided to do, say, a reading on him and then I'm, I'm seeing that he's a murderer and he's a, a drug trafficker or whatever, that's something that wasn't in the news. So, I can't, even though I, that's what I'm seeing, 
I can't just publicly come out and just call this person name and be like whatever, whatever, whatever. But considering the fact that say it was in the news and say speak about him and say human trafficking, I can repeat that verbatim. You understand what I'm saying? Because it's something that's public information. So I just kind of feel like it's the right way and the wrong way to do anything, honey. Everybody don't shake and move the same way, okay? But I'm sassy and classy over here with how I do things, child, okay? And I don't worry about what other people is doing. So, um, yeah, whether I know who persons are involved or not, it's not my job. I've done my job. You understand what I'm saying? But it is not my job to um, uh, point the finger and assign the blame and call people names and things. It's not what I'm supposed to do. If I was led by spirit to do such a thing, then hey, it is what it is. But as, as of now... Um, Spirit is not giving me permission to do so I don't feel like it's necessary for me to have to do so Either, okay Um But, um Yeah guys, so thank you all so very much For listening and for watching Um, if you would be so kind So please Like, share, and subscribe It would be greatly, greatly appreciated I do thank you all in advance Um for any person who is interested in contacting me, you can do so at tip.diamond.36 at gmail.com. You can also follow me on Instagram, which is shine bright like a diamond, uh, three six with the underscore between each word. Um, for any persons who would like to donate um, to the channel, you can do so through Cash App, which is dollar sign tip diamond three six. Or through um, PayPal, which is paypal.me slash at 36 diamonds, guys. As always, y'all take care of yourself, take care of each other, but most of all, take care of your baby, sonny. Remember, this is a wicked, wicked world that we live in. Hold on, guys. There's wickedness in high places, and there's evil that is lurking around each and every corner, even in a neighborhood near you. So y'all watch your surroundings. Watch the company you keep. Watch the surroundings in the company in which your children are in as well. And consider the fact that you never know when someone may betray you, backstab you, try to hurt you, or harm you, honey. Keep you some protection on you. Um... Y'all stay awake, stay aware, stay vigilant, and stay prepared. Because if you stay ready, you ain't got to get ready, baby. Until the next time, peace, love, and light. Namaste. I am that I am created in the image of God. Y'all go and listen to that song, Come Together, okay? Um, I like um, I Can Tina's version a lot or whatever. Um, but definitely go and listen to Gary Clark Jr.'s version of Come Together. He is so, he, he played it. He made me want to learn how to play the electric guitar the way that man played it during guitar hunting, okay? But anyway, that was like, I don't know, like the theme song that came through on this reading, guys, okay? So, um, yeah, talk to y'all later. Shine
Over me. 